NY Fed policy change could squash stablecoin issuer circles hope for Fed access. Funds structured as stablecoin issuer circles BlackRock Manage USC Reserve Fund generally will be deemed ineligible for the New York Federal Reserve's reverse repurchase program under the new rules. The Federal Reserve Bank of New York NY Fed has curbed its counterparty criteria for its reverse repurchase program RRP Wednesday in a way that could prevent stablecoin issuer circle from accessing the prized Fed facility. According to a press release by the NY Fed, funds organized for a single beneficial owner, registered as 2A7 funds at the Securities and Exchange Commission SEC, generally will be deemed ineligible under the new rules. The Circle Reserve Fund, managed by global investment, management giant BlackRock Advisors, appears to fall into this category. The RRP led selected counterparties money market funds, banks lend overnight to the Fed at a fixed rate, currently at 4. 8%. While the facility was originally created as a stabilization tool for the financial system, it has become a highly attractive vehicle to earn high yield with minimal counterparty risk. Currently, funds in the program reach almost $2.03 trillion. Circles as a gaining access to the RRP would create a stable coin effectively backed by the Fed and could potentially destabilize the financial system, the Bank Policy Institute, an important advocacy group for U.S. banks, said in January. The Fed updated the eligibility rules for the honor facility in ways that could deny access to stable coins. Nick Timurao's chief economic correspondent of the Wall Street Journal tweeted, Circle representatives did not immediately respond to a coin desk request for comment. Circle, issuer of the $31 billion US stablecoin, keeps some $25 billion of the reserves in short-term U.S. Treasury bills in a bespoke black rock managed fund called the Circle Reserve Fund. The Circle Reserve Fund is only available to Circle and was registered as a 2A7 government money market fund, according to Circle's earlier press release and an SEC filing about the fund. Circle's goal for the fund was to gain access via BlackRock to the Fed's RRP, Circle Chief Financial Officer Jeremy Foxjean said in an interview with Coindesk in November. This access would open the way to move us remaining cash reserves from partner banks to the fund under a Fed account, Foxjean added. Last month, USC weathered a crisis and temporarily depegged when it suffered from the sudden collapse of its banking partner Silicon Valley Bank. Some $3.03 billion of USC cash reserve held at SVB remained inaccessible for days, sending shockwaves throughout the stablecoin market until the government bailed out depositors in excess of the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation's deposit insurance limit. Circle took steps to reduce risk from the banking system and now holds its cash reserves primarily at BNY Mellon, a global systemically important bank, the firm said. The calamity caused more than $10 billion in outflows from us and demonstrated how exposed fiat-backed stablecoins are to risks in the traditional banking system.